Hey again everybody, Scott with the Tourist Trap. I hope everybody's out there having a great day again. I have went off the beaten path today, way out into Winter Haven, Florida. It's a little retro restaurant I found called Andy's Drive-In and Andy's Igloo. And the Igloo part is ice cream, of course. And the retro sign is just absolutely incredible. Uh, this place has more than likely been here since the 50s or the 60s. We're going to go in and get get something to eat and look around and see how retro -y this place does look. And, cause it, I found this place and I thought, I've got to go there. Uh, it's not real close to the interstate, about 12 miles from I-4, but I'm assuming it will probably be well worth my trip. So let's go check out Andy's Drive-In. This is one cool retro sign and it is neon and it does light up at night. It says burgers, fries, shakes, Andy's Drive-In Restaurant. So retro, it isn't funny. We're going to go inside and see if we can't get a table and get some food because I'm hungry. And right outside of the restaurant part of Andy's Drive-In is Andy's Igloo where you can get uh, frozen treats and ice cream as a walk-up type dairy bar uh, thing. And I believe it's pretty popular with the locals here in Winter Haven. And Andy's Diner here is very, very retro. Something from the 1950s for sure. Pretty cool looking. Lots of lots of people in here. It's a packed house. And here at Andy's Drive-In, they have a retro looking menu here, which is very cool. I did get the steak at sandwich, which they said the steak at sandwich was really good. And I got the onion rings, and I'm hoping these onion rings are like the drive-in back home. And they have a little logo here on the side that says voted best burgers milkshakes and fries a little retro looking burger sign right there pretty cool and another thing I noticed that they have here in their dining room is a retro looking coca-cola cooler that is a pretty sharp looking coca-cola cooler if I do say so myself and uh, kind of a happy days look back here uh, Andy's for a tasty bite very cool looking uh, signage and uh, nice little retro looking booths. It says right here in Winter Haven, Florida, Andy's is the place to go for fine food at reasonable prices. I was getting ready to say, I hope this isn't mine because that looks awful big. You said that was small. Well, it's small to me. <laughs> okay. But yeah, that looks, that looks really, really good. That is the classic burger there. And as you can see, this basket is pretty big. These are big onion rings. Um, they do look good. They're very breaded. And this basket does come with a side of coleslaw. And this is a treat for sure. And the surroundings here, it's just uh, like a trip back in time. Uh, everything smells so good and I can't wait to eat, eat this sandwich and these uh, onion rings. And Andy's Igloo has a big selection of hand dipped ice cream flavors here uh, everybody screams for ice cream and uh, also milkshakes and sundaes these look really good look at that banana split there right on the outside of Andy's drive-in restaurant here in Winter Haven is a walk-up takeout order window where you can pick it up uh, for extra fast service you can call ahead and uh, this is an absolutely fabulous place highly recommend this off the beaten path for sure definitely take that detour over here to Andy's uh, drive-in restaurant in Winter Haven. Well that is Andy's drive-in restaurant since 1951 right here in Winter Haven, Florida. Well I have to say Andy's drive-in restaurant here in Winter Haven, Florida absolutely incredible. The breading on those onion rings oh my goodness I can't even hardly describe the breading. I've, I've never had onion rings that good in years uh, since uh, my days when I lived in Kentucky at an old drive-in there that went out of business uh, called the Bluegrass Grill in Ashland, Kentucky. And uh, this is kind of like that. It's uh, been here since 1951. The burger of uh, the basket was absolutely used. And the one thing I ate first was the coleslaw. And the coleslaw, I have to tell you, that's the coleslaw I remember growing up. Uh, the taste of it, the sweetness, 
Uh, you just don't find that at restaurants these days, this type of coleslaw that they are making here. They did say they make it fresh every day. Uh, and it's actually, to me, tastes like what Kentucky Fried Chicken's coleslaw used to taste like back in the 70s and the 80s. It don't taste like that no more. Uh, but if you want to get some good coleslaw and a good burger and good atmosphere, I haven't tried their ice cream. They've been voted best hamburger, best ice cream, uh, all kinds of stuff. Uh, staff here is super nice, super friendly. Talked to me in a long time. Uh, welcomed me here. Uh, Thank me for coming in. Told me to have a great day. Of course, I always go out there and make it a great day. And uh, this is a gr good detour to take if you're wanting uh, to go a little retro and uh, relive some memories. Um, you know, there's places that claim to be retro type burgers, but this is the real deal here. This is the real deal. The coleslaw, that was, a, that was definitely the real deal. And I told her it was the real deal. Uh, check out the link in the description. Definitely come here and check this place out. I will have to come back here. And it's about 12 miles from I-4, but definitely worth the trip. Uh, remember, go out there and make it a great day because you deserve it.